continue to rise, leaving motorists with no choice but to open up their wallets. Arlette Youssef reports. Large vehicles have always been known to be gas guzzlers, but now even small vehicles are causing pain at the pump. For some drivers, the weekly gas expense stretches to several hundred dollars. Motorists standing, watching their money flood into their gas tank. Last year in November, 189 a gallon for 87, and I always fuel up either Chevron or Shell, and <laughs> it's ridiculous. I mean, more than a dollar in less than a year. Even those with compact cars couldn't escape the rise. Probably for a tank of gas, fifteen to twenty dollars each time. It's actually cheaper here in Yuma than it is in Phoenix. I live in Phoenix, and uh, it's almost three seventy a gallon in Phoenix. Shearer says his work truck is even worse. Last time I drove it, about two days ago, I ended up spending about one hundred twenty dollars. One hundred and twenty dollars for fifty gallons of gas. It's too much. It really is. It's, it's going to create a hardship, but it doesn't look like it's stopping. 25 gallons at 387, 97.25. GasBuddy.com shows the Imperial Valley is currently averaging $4.19 per gallon for regular gas, which is roughly $5 to $10 more than just a couple weeks ago. According to AAA, gas prices are up $1.30 compared to this time last year and already 10 cents up from just last week locally. Reporting in Yuma, Arlette Youssef, 13 on your side.